Welcome to Paradis Diaries where we are hunting spring this week. In November 2017, we moved to the beautiful Ynys Morn, the island of Anglesey in northwest Wales, to begin the adventure of developing a 12 acre small holding and planting a church, all while learning to be parents for the first time. Moving to a tiny rural village called Paradis, which is Welsh for paradise, our pioneering journey has seen us venture way out of our comfort zone, trying new things, succeeding at some and facing challenges in others. This is our way to share our journey, encourage you with yours, and of course, share plenty of inspiring scenery and cute shots of animals and our young family. We are the Radbourne family, and this is Paradis Diaries. Yes, welcome to Paradis Diaries, where today we are looking for the first signs of spring. Now, as we record this, today is actually the 6th of February. We tend to record a week before it actually goes out. Um, so you might be thinking, first signs of spring, it's been cold and snowy all week. But that's the reason why we're recording this today, because today is a gloriously sunny day. And we know that the weather forecast for the rest of the week is freezing cold temperatures and snow. So we are on a bit of a hunt today to try and find the first signs of spring to give us hope that it is on its way. And before winter fully grabs us again, we are looking for these first signs of spring just to keep us going through this next week and to know that it is okay. Spring is coming. So for example, we have got daffodils that are on their way. In some places I can see that they've already almost flowered as well. Oh, so um, we as a family are gonna go for a little walk today and we're gonna try and find all the little, very, very early signs of spring to share with you and get excited about something that we just cannot wait for. Are these all daffodils, are they? Look, there's lots here, aren't there? I love that. Yeah. I'm very excited about spring, Alan. <laughs> there's some, look. That's right. That's good, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, let's go and have a look for some of the signs, shall we? Here. Little leaf starting to come. Yeah. <laughs> little birds on the lilac tree. I think it's a lilac tree. I think that there is a little Tito Thomas Lass, a little blue tit, starting to nest in here. Right, and then just outside of our driveway, look. What are these? See them there? That's it. What are they? They're called snowdrops. Yeah, that's it. They drop like that, don't they? They're lovely, aren't they? They're very pretty. Listen really, really closely. And you can hear the birdies singing. So listen. Or you would do if a tractor wasn't about to come past. So if you listen really closely around here, you can maybe hear the bird song behind the agricultural vehicles. It's coming. Daddy, wait. Oh. Wow. Who needs bird song when you got tractors, eh? Right. Try and listen very closely, see if you can hear the birds. Oh yeah. I think I'll hear one. Come on, birdie! This is woken up from his nap and she's joining us. Hooray! <laughs> hey Caleb, Tidy's just told me that the rhubarb's starting to come up as well. Should we go and have a look? That's over in the far corner, by the gate. Signs of spring, Gracie. Little lambs. Should we go see if we can find some fat sheep? Yeah? 
the sheep herders, they're ready. There they are, look. You're right, Griff. <laughs> oh, we've got some sheep nuts. Hey! So in the fields around here, there's loads of little lambs starting to appear. Our girls won't be ready until kind of March time. Um, hopefully, we're not actually sure, we've not got them scanned, so we don't know if they're pregnant, but a few of them are looking a little bit chubbier. So we're hopeful that that isn't just that we're feeding them too much hay, but that um, they've got little lambs on the way. And that's a brilliant sign of spring, isn't it? Hi dear, hi dear, hi dear. Are there any signs of spring up here, Caleb? Mm, yeah. There you go, Gonzo. How's your eye? Is it okay now? Yeah? Deep. So we're really looking forward to spring now. There's just those little signs. And although we know the weather forecast is for cold, and snow this week we're just holding on to the fact that it's coming it's on its way so i hope you've enjoyed seeing the little signs of spring and just as a family going around and exploring this week and um, we will see you next week on paradise diaries what's on telly um rugby rugby six nations has started that's a sign of spring eh hooray hooray Our den, Caleb. Yeah. Yeah. It's good, isn't it? Mm. You know the best bit about our den? We've managed to build this amazing structure and still be able to watch the cricket. Yeah. 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 Okay. Bye bye.